Hi viewers, welcome to Penhouse.in. In this video, we are going to see a short review on Gamma Number no. Two uh, with the red cap and transparent body finish uh, fountain pen and eye dropper model one. And this video is specifically taken to uh, give a clear insight on the pens because just with the photos you can't uh, fully understand the pen. So here, this pen has a golden uh, clip and a golden ring on the cap. And the brand's name Gamma, Gamma was stamped on the body, and here the pen held, uh, pen's cap held on this body with the thread mechanism. And here this is number eight nib, and also number thirty-five nibs also suits this pen, and uh, you can swap the nibs as you like since we have number eight and number uh, thirty-five nibs in many brands, and usually pen enthusiasts will swap with candrate nibs and where you can find a, a fine medium and broad nibs and again with the gold and golden uh, dual tone and with silver plated nibs also and also you can use a number uh, flex nibs in number 35 uh, also suits this pen and this is upon your choice and for that you can go to our site and click pen spares then go to nibs and there you can use filters and make a query on what you require and here I'm going to show the pen's entire weight and the breadth of holding areas uh, diameters. This is 10.2 uh, mm and the body of this pen is 11.9 mm. And the length of this pen without cap is 121.4 mm and again with cap it is 134.8 mm and the entire weight of this pen is 17 grams And also the reservoir capacity is more so we can fill more than 3 ml of inks in this pen and uh, also please note since this is a transparent body please do not use primary color inks so that it will create a strain on this wall of this pen and uh, another important thing is pen maintenance please wash the pen regularly that is twice a month because all the dye based ink will precipitate on longer usage and it will block the uh, inners of uh, feed us passage and so it will get you will get a scratchy writing inside and slowly the ink will dry quickly then you may have to um, shake the pens for the ink flow, uh, flow to come out and I think you may experience this and the reason is the blockage in the feeder grow. so to clean the deposits and dirts please remove the feeder unit and nib separately by holding the nibs and feeders together and twist and pull again hold this is a simple two minutes process so you, then you can um, after removing you can then fle uh, flush the feeder with the help of toothbrush or clean with any soap uh, soap waters or with in tap, running tap waters also so if you are soaking in soap water then allow it for one hour and brush and clean and in the ink bottles itself you can notice on every fill it is recommended to clean the pen with water and so it is unless otherwise we have to um, we have good cleaning and maintenance the flow will be affected and again on maintenance all the threads are turned to worn out so to increase the life of the threads please apply a silicone grease or vaseline every time whenever you open and close the grip area during ink fill and also uh, whenever you fill the ink fill below the inner threads uh, so if you fill above uh, in excess the leakage path will created and you will spoil your hands and also few nibs need to be fine-tuned because during manual assembly of nibs the tines may stick together so gently push the tine up and down so that it will create a space in between and so the ink flow will uh, come out well and in turn you will get smooth writing also 
and please ensure both tines are in parallel if not you will get a scratchy writing and whenever we dispatch the pens to our customer we do this fine tuning and we will check before dispatch this is our usual practice here i'm going to give the writing sample of this pen for that i'm using our penthouse violet color ink Wow, this is so smooth. So smooth and soft like butter. Yeah. And if you have any query about this pen, you can ask in the comment section or else you can make a call to a mobile number. Thanks for watching this video. Thank you.